Welcome back, everybody. I am the Jimmer. This is the Bunker Assault. We're on episodes four. Yeah, we're up, up to episode four. We've got the Oil Fort by Mania Man. A very fitting name. Obviously modeled after an oil uh, platform, but uh, maybe hastily upgraded in times of war for coastal defense gave this one a aesthetic score of uh, actually gave it pretty good for 40 seconds I think with paint it could have got the full 60 seconds but uh, the lack of paint really hurt it but uh, this, cr this crane right here definitely helps very very nice Got the rapid fire Gatling gun. Or Gatlin gun. Excuse my mispronunciation. And then the slower firing main gun. As well as some missiles. And a uh, fairly powerful lamb system on this. Like how it's uh, got the lamps out here as well. Nice touch. This is the oil fort by Mania Man. I believe this is the first Mania Man submission I've received as well. So welcome aboard and uh, glad to have you. And uh, let's get this started. Oh, this does have um, quite a bit of shielding too. I uh, skipped through or I unpaused just for a second just to, yeah, you can see the uh, shielding starting to light up there. It has good shielding all around, but it is set to invisible as to you know, not ruin the aesthetics. Oh, is it firing at the, uh, oh gosh darn it. <laughs> yeah, uh, once again, not, uh, not setting the, uh, the firing restrictions. The maximum range allowed is, um, 1500 meters, you're supposed to be fighting the, um, Triceratops. Not uh, attacking the uh, out of bounds assault force. So I'm uh, like like it happened with the uh, the summit class. I'm not gonna re re oh detonating one of the nukes. I'm not gonna redo this. I'm just gonna slap on a pretty hefty time penalty and uh, just let this go. Ceratops swooping around, getting uh, getting some shots in now to the vulnerable backside. I don't think there is any shielding back here. Most of the shielding concentrated at the front. Select the Triceratops in a reloading phase. Oh, that was a pretty good crash. Oh, and there we go. <laughs> that uh, large explosion there marks the arrival of the tumbleheads and their uh, large pest shells. Oh, 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 oh. oh, that tumblehead just nailed the Triceratops. And the oil forts continues to pound away on the, uh, oh, it's the AG, AG5. Vengeance. HRA5 Vengeance. Excuse me. Oil port still above 90%. We're going to go two minutes. We should have our first nukes coming in as well as the uh, Kramer heads. The Kramer heads should be making their way slowly to the battlefield. Hopefully they didn't derp out as they have a tendency to do. It's 
Uh, something with the uh, the new wheels, they just really don't like to work. Oh, and I missed it. Disqual- oh, AI dead. Oh, that is unfortunate, because there was still uh, quite a bit of health left. Was it a nuke? I don't think it was a nuke. Just a lucky shot taking out the AI. But uh, congratulations to Mania Man, Oil Fort, surviving, once again, surviving the longest so far. But uh, not quite as long as I'd hoped. I was hoping more of these entries would survive till the uh, three or four minute mark. Might have been a little overzealous in uh, how I constructed the, the assault force. But uh, that's it for this one. I hope you guys enjoyed the carnage. And all those laser parts. <laughs> if you did, go ahead and uh, give me that thumbs up. And we'll see you next time.